Good morning, squad. How's it going? Let's see. I see a sergeant's dead soon. Phoenix Miller. Darid. We're going to play more Night in the Woods today. And then that'll be the last stream of November. Before we start the 25 days of December streams, miss. Let's go be a cat in the woods. Oh, hey, Roman Goro, Reindisa, Luminaire. Hey, Rocky John. Conspiracy. How's everybody today? I woke up real, real soon ago. Put on the cat booties. Well, that was a weird one. All right, we had the weird dream where we smashed everything. I feel awful. Probably look awful. Oof. Gonna burn this room down with me in it. Be a shrieking ghost. Hey, Kavina. I see we have three cats in the trench coat as well. Ooh, can I look in the mirror? Oh, good. I was alright. Thought never drink again or go in public. Everything feels bad. Boop. Hey, Lady TL. Hey, Metalar. May. Yeah. Come say hi. Okay. Hi, Mom. I'll sit on the counter. You look like crap. Yep. Rough night. Is that obvious? It's just saying you look like crap because I love you. Aww. Thanks. You want to talk about it? It's not cool to party in the year woods. Senior year. He's home from school for the weekend. Did you talk to him? Kinda, sorta. Well, he's a jerk, hon. No, he's not. Or he wasn't. I don't know. Anyway. Looks like most of the repair workers have cleared out the town center. Oh, hey, we can go to new places in town. Finally. Yeah, they're all done with the Churchill steps. And the power lines. Cool. Gonna walk on some power lines. I mean, I'm sorry, Mom. I will not totally walk on power lines, even though I will. I'm 20. Which means you go to jail for it. They'd never catch me. Your Aunt Molly catches you up there. There's no telling what she'd do. I tell you, I saw her out yesterday out front. Really? Yeah, she's been all weird and cryptic. I don't know, everything's fuzzy today. And anyway, it's dangerous. You remember Susie? Nope. Definitely never heard this story a thousand times. Fried, honey. The paper used the word fried. Now she can't use adjectives. She lost an entire part of speech. Oh, that's terrible. See, that's exactly the kind of sentence Susie can't formulate. So, what are you up to today? I don't know. I can go see Greg and B. Can get up to something together? Mm, I don't know. I don't think they hang out much past messing around with their old band equipment. Only so many hours and so many days in our lives. Is there some bug going around that makes people talk like fortune cookies? Friendships are like trees. Uh-huh. You have to water them so they grow. We each only have so much water. Have you ever watered a tree? Oh, no, God does that. Okay, I'm out. See you later, sweetie. Bye, Mom. <laughs> Gonna walk on power lines. Hey, May. Hey, Somers. 
Did I see you in the journal the other day? Oh yeah, doctor's orders. Dr. Hank has me doing one too. You have anger problems too? Stealing painkillers from the Ham Panther Pharmacy. Oh. Dr. Hank sees journals as a general cure-all. Is it working for you? Nope. Rehab and the program do though. I have become a very good poet. Wanna hear one? Nah. Okay, maybe another time. Definitely. It's Selmer's. Aha! Now he's on his roof. Gonna get up there. Gonna go talk to astrology. Astronomy. Right? Different thing. Hey, nice Livick. No, nope, just got started. Woke up from dream. Talking to this dude. May, you could have knocked on the door down there. Impolite to be on other people's roofs. Next time I'm gonna call the cops. Whatever. Ha 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 ha. Any rate, I'm glad you have accepted my invitation. What are you doing anyway? Hunting dusk stars. What is a dusk star? Wandering stars, the light of which does not come through at night. How's that work? Trick of the atmosphere and setting sun. Only visible for a few weeks every year in the spring and fall. Neato. Wanna have a look? Yeah. Boom, boom. Ah, my eyes. Oh, you want to put the filter on, like so. The sun's bright, makes you blind. You didn't think to mention this? Just did. figure this out. tells the story of a woman who built a tower to heaven and for this God sunk her deep into the sea. Well, that screwed up. Even in the depths she refused to die. Oh, will you never die as well? Never! Defy cats as gods also, will you? Gods in these stories are only stand-ins for things we cannot control. You might say floods or the cancer or such. No to all of them. This is fair. Hunting stars in the sky. Oh, 
Find another one. Ah, Dora the murderer. Okay, interested. Dora passed. Burn the king's procession on the street. Dora was quiet, said nothing, and the king took offense to this. Why? Royalty is strange. What happened? Uh, Burn insulted Dor, Dor's family, Dor's village, and so on, until he was down to insulting Dor's chickens. Damn. Hey, Dogma. Dor first murdered Burn's chickens, then his ancestral village, then his family. Oh. And when it came to Burn, the kid was silent. I'm gonna get tattoos of this guy. Is Dor a hero? I don't know, but he doesn't really matter, I think. <clears throat> like, if you'd been- if you'd been told you're nothing before, a story like this sounds pretty okay. And it's a true story and real people died, and you should feel terrible. Seriously? Bah. I believe we've seen both stars visible today. Oh, really? Come and go so fast. That was pretty great. We can look again in two days' time. Will you be back? Yeah, sure. Oh, you will be. No one can resist the stars forever. That's spooky, Mr. Chesokov. I drew some star pictures. Churchill is now around and I can get on the power lines. Yeah, yeah. I remember this part. where all the stuff ended up. I remember the spring parade. It was so much fun. Until that year that Mallard P. Blooming Grove snapped his tether and ran over Chris Evans. Then they cancelled the parade. Cowards. Couldn't cage Mallard. Mallard needed to be free. And neither ropes nor the poor legs of Chris Evans could hold him back. Wonder what happened to both of them. Locked. That's a fire hazard. Ah, oh, Mallard! What have they done to you? Oh, Mallard, you're pregnant. It's one of those god things. Like, when you have a baby because God? Oh, you are a cute vermin. Who's the best vermin? You are. You look hungry. Is that why you're not doing anything? I'll come back with food. Don't die. Oh, no, I don't want to make them squeak. That seems mean. Miracle rats.
I bet rat babies would like a pretzel. Okay. I'm only gonna get one shot at this. Just gotta freeze when he looks over. Even if you're holding a pretzel. No movement. Still got it. Okay. I am the bandit queen. What sort of is the plot? Uh, we moved back from... Well, we quit college, came home, and... Ran into an old boyfriend. We did something ages ago that people don't like us for. Alright, I forgot I need to go up the steps to get the... to make that work. Hey Valkyrie! Mwah! Hi! Hi, sorry. I didn't realize you didn't hear me come upstairs. Love you. Hi. Can I have four dollars? Uh, yeah. Give me. I I think there's some on the armor. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Didn't hear him. Looks spooky. We're gonna feed rats. You are here, okay. I thought you went away. There we go. Ah, you're hungry. Very hungry. Guess I'm your mom now? I don't know if I'm ready to be a mom. Oh, I got an achievement. Mother of Vermin. Neat. Can I look back in there again? Or is that like just done now? That oh, looks like it's just done now. Bum bum. Go a different way. Mm 
Yo. Hey. Hey, it's you. It's me. I'm sit. Legs are killing me. Yeah, it's a hike to get up here, right? I'm just getting old. 20 years. You're like all the way old. How old are you? 15 in February. I used to hang out here after school. Really? Most kids don't come all the way up here. That's why it's so nice. Better than being at home. Where do you live? Chestnut Street. Okay, out by the tracks? Yeah, guess I'm not really town. I'm like, tracks. I live down on Maple. Ooh, the rich neighborhood. Huh? What? Oh, sorry. I just meant it's nice. Huff huff. Never mind. It's okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. Calm down. Sorry I get all weird sometimes. I'm sorry. I'll forgive you if you stop apologizing. Okay. The tracks are cool. I haven't been out there in a while. The train checks my room at night. Yeah, in the winter I can hear it. One of my favorite noises. Well, you don't have to wake up with bits of ceiling on you. Good point. Alright. I'm out. Nice chatting. I'm here most days. Cool. See you later. See you, killer. Ugh. Years ago, I thought when I was 20, I'd never be able to climb this high up anymore. Shows what you know, little me. Roof cat is correct. Sounds good, roof cat. You were correct. Mm -hmm. Up the steps. There are non humanoid cats in this world. Yeah, I still find that weird, but yes. In fancy building. Hey, mom. Hey, hun. Hey, mom. It's been a while since I was in here. I know, sweetie. Nice to see you in the building, at least. Did you meet the new pastor? Nope. Oh, she's around somewhere. Might be outside. She likes to go on walks. Cool. Cool, I'm gonna bump into her. How's church working? Good. Answering the phone. Entering data of various sorts. Trying to get everything into one unified app... thing. You know, they make programs just for church administration? I didn't. I was watching online tutorials for the one we just got. I just got distracted by true crime videos. Mom. You were slacking off at work. God will forgive me. Alright, I better work. Okay. Goodbye, Mom. Enjoy your book. Um. Hey, hey, Candy, Candy's daughter. Yep, who are you? I'm Kate, but you can call me Pastor K. That's like way more syllables. You're new here, right? 16 months, something like that. Oh, you and me at least. This over here is Bruce. Hey, hey. Bruce is new to our community. Do you live in the woods? Yep. 
But not for long, we're working on fixing that before winter gets here. Gonna take some doing, but God's a doer, and they're bigger than city council. Still thinks it's a lot of trouble to go to. Listen, nobody said loving your neighbor would be easy. You are our actual neighbor. I appreciate it. I'll need a little help sometimes, Bruce. No shame in hard times. <laughs> well, it was nice meeting you both. Come and see me at the church sometime. Sure. See you later, Bruce. Okay, nice to meet you, Mary. May. It's May. Bruce. That's Bruce. Pastor. Pastor Kate. The drawing. Oh, I got one of Bruce, too. How far can I go? Edge of that rock. Got it. I was wanting to climb the water tower. Then that one kid died doing that. Whatever. I'll get to it. Probably see clear to brittle from here. Yeah, the literal edge of this world. Oh, one of them anyway. Just gonna go find the friends. So I guess I should check to see if they're at work. How's it going? Got a job here, that's cool. Oh nice. Actually I'm lying, it sucks. Oh well. I had no idea there were so many kinds of hammers. And wrenches and nails. Oh, the nails. Oh, that sounds tough. Hey B. Yo. Sorry about last night. Got woozy on cold medicine. So I don't really know what I expected to happen. Sorry for what I said. You know, I don't really remember it much. So whatevs. Hooray for alcohol. New town motto. Band practice? Yep. Nice, it's still a thing. We were barely even a band in high school. It's fun. You get to hang out with Angus. How did you even end up doing it? When Casey left town, Angus told me that Greg was real sad. So I volunteered to be the new drummer. Well, drummer. It's a laptop B. Sure is, May. Sure is. See you later. I got work to do. Okay. Oh, hello. Hey. Yo. We got, like, the same shirt. No, my shirt's completely different, dude. But like opposites. Yeah, what do you know? What's your shirt from? From? Yeah, is it like a band or something? Yeah, I made it at home in home mech back in high school. I just like the symbol. It's a null symbol, right? I don't know. What's your shirt mean? Secret symbol of God's wrestling league. Whoa, what's that? Backyard wrestling. Whoa. Where does it happen? All over the place. Backyards. Probably. How did I not know about this? It's a secret, because it's legal, I think. And people go to the hospital and stuff. Oh, it's awesome. It's awesome. Ah, I'm gonna look this up. See you there sometime. Cool. Hey, Angus. Hey, May. How's it going? You're like the third person I've seen today. 
I know you explained it, but I have zero clue how this place stays open. You'd be surprised. Band practice later? Gotta warm up my voice. You growl real good. Thanks, I'm a born growler. When I was a baby, I never cried. I just growled. I think I cried non-stop until I was like nine. And then I cried all the time again, starting at like 13. You had a good three years not crying in there. They were really productive years. <clears throat> well, cool story, bro. What the? What? No! No, 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 no! Past abilities is gone! Meet you for 28 wonderful years, love, Sal and Jan. No more pizza delivery! No more big Sal! No more special birthdays! This is the worst thing that's happened to this town. Since the flood that took out... Um... The petting zoo. Thank goodness all the animals swam to safety on the roof of the tire place. Who, who knew goats were such good swimmers? I'm so depressed now. Hello. Jeremy. Jeremy Wharton? No one calls me that. Germ, right? Germ warfare. Oh, that's stuck, huh? Yep. That's an okay name. Your name is May. Yep. That's an okay name. Okay. You're like a year behind me, right? Two years. So you're fresh out? I hang out with Greg sometimes. We ride bikes. Pretty good at it. Okay. What? I saw a rabbit possum the other day. Where? Where? Who was crawling across the road? Had it been hit by a car? Nah, just a rabbit. What happened to it? Got hit by a car. Wow. It was like a poem. Okay. Hey, Coyote. Well, look who it is. Yep, alive for another day. How are you feeling? It's feeling pretty bad, but I've been across town and I uh, don't know if that helped. Fresh air, or as fresh as it gets around here. Delicious. So what's up? I'm gonna head out to band practice. Practice. Yes. Crashed my bike once and a broken spoke went through my leg. Ooh. It's kinda cool. Oh yeah, I can see that. Alright kids, gotta head out soon. Where are you going? Family stuff. Okay. Just for a night. We doing this? Yeah, let's do this. Wait, I don't know the song. Like at all. Barely remember how to play bass. You'll be fine. I will not be fine. Zero self-confidence, huh? No, I just don't know the song. It's jerks.
Oh, it slipped up right at the end. <clears throat> I guess all the rhythm have cafe training is paying off. Uh, no, this is uh, this is on uh, uh, Steam. I'm using the PS4 controller though. That was pretty much perfect. Uh, whoa, yeah, all a day's work. This is my song section of my bullet journal. Hey, talk to anybody? Hey, hey, dear. Are you sleeping for the night? Yeah, gonna be bored. Rather, I would be if I didn't have plans. Plans. Crimes. Ooh, crimes. You up for some crimes? I just, I, I just remember, forgot about crimes. Let me check with Bay first. Cool, let me know. Wanna do something tonight? Um, I promise it'll be an improvement on last night. What were you thinking of doing? Um, wanna go to the mall? The mall? Yeah, for Lucene, like we did when we were kids. When was the last time you were at the Fort Lucene Mall? Oh, five years ago? Yeah, uh, what? You know what? Yeah, let's go. Great. Promise it'll be great. Okay, we sure we're doing this? Hmm. Alright, mall or crimes? I mean, crime sounds way more fun. I think we did crimes when we were with Kathleen, though, so maybe... Yeah, let's go mauling. Let's see what this does. Glad I didn't puke in here. Me too. Maybe I just never drink again. Or maybe you just take it easy next time. I don't know if I do moderation well. I can see that. I think the term is risk-taking behavior. Are you seeing someone about this? Hanging with you is pretty- is working pretty well tonight. No pressure. I should be getting paid by the hour. I got gum. I'm going to turn on the radio now. Old Gods of the Fort Lucin Mall. Fort Lucin! OMG! Yep. What the hell happened? Ah, uh, the internet? Aw, oh, thanks for the cheer, Kavina. Go in the mall, let's get shoes. We in the internet when we used to come here. I'm into the carousel. Sold it, I guess. Who buys a carousel? Nobody who comes here. What happened to the bookstore? Also the internet. Have into the arcade. I'm gonna make a sign that says the internet and hold it up until you're done asking. Happen to internet. Ooh, a dollar store. And yet Dollar Empire is still here. I think it's one of the things the internet can't compete with. I used to go in here when I was a kid. You gonna get you could get an eraser for a dollar. A pencil for a dollar. Usually doesn't sound like a good deal. Oh god, you're right. OMG. The Rev is still here. Yeah, this little thing. I can feel the edginess from here. Just looking in there makes me feel old. You're still gonna do this. There's no way I'm going in there. Oh, 
Ashley. Crap. I'm 14 again. Yep, pretty nuts in here. He isn't that. Shut up. Hey, ladies. Hello, lady. Just so you know, we have 20% off select shirts. Ooh, t shirts. Yep. Thanks a lot. Okay. Catch you later. Alright. Haha, <laughs> nice. Dead Party Boys stickers in 2017. I think they're back in. Hmm, that's cool. Bet you listen to them. Uh, yeah, they're good. Yeah, if you're 30 years old and sad, I'm getting there. They don't even have any witch dagger stuff. We well, have stuff that's cool with like 13 year olds. Isn't that a witch dagger backlit poster? Oh, huh. Looks like they have a few of them. I think I saw a whole witch dagger thing on way in. Okay, okay. You should go hang out with the 13 year olds. Stop it. You have so much in common. I swear I will seal your car and leave you here. When you even know how to drive. Hmm. Haven't seen belt buckles in a while. At least not fashionable ones. Make it the shop has one with a rattlesnake driving a semi truck. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Do what? Cover me, I'm gonna grab one. What? No. Shh. I'm not doing this. I'm really gonna do this? Be cool. My first time doing crimes. What other crimes have you done? Shoplifting. Vandalism. Piracy. Shoplifting again. Now. Anyway, I just do the easy crimes. How is this stupid idea easy? Our eyes evolved to notice movement. Like, dinosaurs? The dinosaur is moving. Wait, that's not. Never mind. So as long as you're perfectly still when the clerk is watching. Like, you're gonna freeze when she looks over. Even if you're in the middle of putting it in your pocket, this is gonna work because dinosaurs, just like dinosaurs. I'm gonna pretend to not know you till you're done, okay? Sweet. Okay, are you done? Oh yeah. Shut and let's get out of here. Dinosaurs. Oh yeah, sweet back belt buckle I am never ever going to wear. Rubs against my stomach. This is bad, May. You should steal something now. Pardon? Haven't you ever done, like, any crimes? I mean, yeah, I guess, hasn't everyone? Well, get back in there, champ. What? No. Beatrice, let me lay this out. One, the security cameras aren't even on in there. Two, the cashier clearly isn't paying attention. Three, there is not one mall cop here, as far as I can tell. I don't know, I mean... B, this is an excellent experience. Have it. I'll run interference. Okay, but I'm blaming you and driving away if I get caught. Perfect. We are bad friends. Okay, I'm gonna run interference while you do your thing. What do you mean? I'm gonna distract the clerk. I can do this. Okay, well, I will admit that drawing attention is a talent you have. I'm great at crimes. What if I get caught? You won't. I'll just start screaming if I have to. How is that a good idea? Let's go. Okay. If this goes wrong, I'm blaming you. Join the club. Hey. Uh-huh. I got a question. T-shirts are 20% off. Yeah, I saw. I was wondering about something else. Okay. The name of the store. Yeah. 
You probably get this question a lot. Try me. Is it like, you revolution or your revolution? You know, no one ever asks this, but I think it's about, about it all the time. I bet. God. You know what the official business name on our checks is? You Revolution. Radical Youth Culture Uprising, Inc. That's real dumb. Oh god, I know. Like, guys can't just be a store that sells cool shit to teens? Well, teens do go nuts for this. <laughs> the employee discount is also pretty great. I had a job once. Had a 100% discount. Uh-huh. When I stole shit. Wait, why would I say this? This is dumb. No, I got what you meant the first time. I bet you grab things all the time. Well, they're big into prosecuting to the full extent of the law here, so... Okay, I'm done looking. Let's go. Oh, there's a nice time to buy now. Uh, see ya. Hey, Cyclops boy. An anti crepe skewer. Why did I do that? You did so well, B. I call the cops on shoplifters at my own store. This. Have you even shoplifted before? No, never. Okay, now you're making me feel weird about it. Sorry? Forget it. We're home free. Really? Yeah, we're like out in open waters now. I feel kind of sick. Let's walk it off. We are bad friends. <laughs> Sorry, B. Ah, oh, I forgot about this giant fish head. Oh my god, I loved her. Did you ever come to the summer days thing here? <clears throat> Yeah, I'd like squirt people. I still have no idea how they did that. One time I saw it knock a guy down. Yeah, every year that would happen and someone would make a fuss. But like, I don't know. You showed up to be squirted by a fish fountain. You know, the walkway up there? Past the upper food court thing? Up in the atrium? The what? Ceiling. The glass part that opens and points up. Yeah. When I was a kid, I thought that's where God lived. Wow. I know, just remember staring at it when I was a kid. Like, eating a burger and trying to see if I could see God. And peeking over or something. Looks like they've got some weird hanging art up there now. Wanna go up and see? Nah, my knees are killing me from work. Yep, for eating? We'll do that after. Bookstore. Hey, music store. <clears throat> this should be good. Wonder what kind of. Oh, come on. There's no one working the counter. Oh, wow. Hello? Anyone here? This is bleak. This is like something out of a failed state or something. Oh, I worked at a company that had a store that looked like this. Three items on the shelves. When you make a country and it doesn't work out. So, like this country? A. A. Ruins. Let's see what they've got. Honky tonk arm again. Oh, I'd actually listen to that just to see what the hell it even means. Cover's got a pickup truck exactly like my uncle's. This one's on fire and flying at a dragon space. Upgrade. Oh, hey, it's that band. What band? You know, you remember this song? Had that video that people posted like a zillion times? I've literally no idea what you're talking about. It had that weird horse in it horse. Oh yeah, I remember. Had a weird horse in it. Yeah, that horse was all horsing around. I remember. And and this horsing. Yep, we've officially remembered that video. We did it. Edge of town. 
I, edge of store. Looks like that. Oh, I can't jump in the mall. It's weird that I would follow the rules of the mall and not jump around in it. Alright, well, let's eat. Let's eat. Okay. Expected more excitement. Mall food court dinner. Oh, what a feeling. See? That wasn't hard. <laughs> what did you get? You inhaled it before I got a look. Uh, ooh, pierogi burger. It's just a big pile of carbs and meat, huh? Isn't that what we are? Bones, too. I don't want bones in my burger. Rain. What? Eh. Uh, Remember when Kathy Domingo pulled out Cindy Clark's nose ring here? You know what that was about, right? Wasn't Kathy pregnant with, what was his name, football guy? Ron Boonstra. I didn't know that you knew about that. Well, I mean, there was that first football game of our senior year. And Ron ran up to the sideline and yelled at the Sands, My first touchdowns for my beautiful firstborn and his mommy, Kathy Domingo. That's something. Kathy was in marching band and she was crying, I think. And then he dumped her for Cindy a week later. Oh yeah, see that's the part I know about. That's what set off the whole nose ring situation. Mm, don't care about Ron. What's Cindy doing? I imagine she got a new nose ring. Conversely, never wanted a nose ring ever again. You know what the worst part of the story is. Cindy having something ripped out of her face. At the time I was like, God moves things around in the strangest ways to bring two people together. I don't know if I even believe in God. Same really. Thinking about this place, the fountain, God walkway and stuff, not knowing how something worked used to seem like magic. Now not knowing means it might be going wrong and I may not be able to fix it. Help knowing someone was at the controls, you know. Now I'm just tired all the time from the shop. When I was at school, yeah, I don't even want to talk about it. It happened anyway. Want to run around the mall some more? There's not really much else to run around. We can check out the weird bad art upstairs. I want to touch it. Please don't. I want to run. You run, I'm going to sit here. I'm tired and sad now. Suit yourself. I can jump too. Oh yeah. Safe. Can I jump on the artwork? Oh, I can. This seems like a terrible idea. What's this? Oh wow. Is this... I guess I found the lights? <laughs> Fantastic. Whoa, hey. Oh, I see. I found the water controls. I think it was about there. Okay. 
Oh, and I've got movement. A weird mini game. Beatrice and hello. Don't give them our names. Beatrice Jones. Oh wow, is that you, God? Yes, it is I, God Stevenson. I didn't know you had a last name. Silence, mortal. Through my fish monster, I have lain waste to your kind. I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty magical. Silence! I shan't say it again. You and your good and noble companion shall get ice cream on the way home. Yeah, we should probably get out of here. Before you're arrested. The cops shall be confused and stuff and beat each other up. For I am God and I hate cops. Okay, okay, get down here. Have a good one, mortals. I'm glad we went to the mall. Because it's not sticking to it's the man. The man isn't going to lose anything here. She will get into a lot of trouble. She's just a cog in a much bigger machine, huh? Sure, whatever. Return the shit. Okay, okay, I'm going. Hi. Hello. You're back. Yeah, we stole some stuff. Here's what that stuff. We don't want you to get in trouble with your boss. It's not your fault the world is like it is. Hey, Metric Furlong. What, you stole this? We're just a cog in a much bigger machine. To blame you would be like blaming a thing inside a whole thing. So you're returning stolen merchandise. One day folks like you are going to overthrow the whole thing. What whole thing? The whole thing. We're leaving. Stay strong, you beautiful dreamer. You have nothing to lose but your chains. What? <laughs> this place used to be something. I mean, it's still something. Yeah, just a big, mostly empty thing. In a big, mostly empty parking lot. Well, you work with what you got. Let's never come here again. Don't have to convince me. I only came here because you wanted to. Well, Fort Lucene used to be something. Now Fort Lucene's over. Let's go. Let it die in peace. Let it die. I want to drive on the way home. Nope. Good call, B. Do not let me drive. Bandit Queens. Hey, Dad. Heard you had a wild time last night. I didn't drink. Works better if you let me accuse you first. Right. Here's my hangover cure. Not drinking the night before. Wow, hold on. Let me write that down. It's complicated, I know. What did you do tonight? Went out with B. Have a good time? Yeah, she's kind of, I don't know. Like, she's older, like, much older, and kinda sad. Well, she's been through a lot. Yeah. Hey, Dad, would you mind moving the boxes in the crawl space? Well, what have you done for me lately? Been an excellent daughter. That doesn't count. Well, would you watch some TV with me? Yeah. Hop up. I'm watching Garbo and Malloy. Nice. Welcome back, folks. Hell of a show tonight. 
Same, Eloy. Yes, Garbo? I ever get the feeling disaster is right around the corner? Sure do, right before we start the show every night. Superstitious, Garbo? Not anymore. What happened? I broke every mirror I've ever owned, and now I'm lucky enough to never have to look at this mug. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, but what about the rest of us? What? What's that about? Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Coming up next, Garbo and I join a cult. Oh, that was fun, Dad. I, apparently, I don't have anything else to say to you, so I'm gonna go upstairs. Box is still here. Weird how big clocks are like luxury furniture now. Since everything has a clock and internet on it, like having something big that only does one thing is like a statement or something. Doo -doo. Hey, people are online. Oops, wrong button. Hey, cool mall times. Pretty cool mall times, yes. Oh, we didn't make too much of a mess with the fountain. Who's we? I was merely sitting there when I was assaulted with mall water. I will not rest until that fountain is brought to justice. Tell the world my story. They must know. Oh, okay, I'm going to sleep. Hope the nightmares aren't too horrible. This is a trauma I shall bear forever. Hey, hey, dude, what did you do tonight? Not much. Stole something. For Angus. It's a surprise. <gasps> wow, what is it? Hold on for a sec. Oh, I gotta go. Okay, weirdo. <laughs> Alright. I have no way to search the internet to find out what, uh, what backyard wrestling's about. I guess I have to do something else for that. Bedtime. Yes. <laughs> Running in a silhouette. Ooh, dream time. No baseball bat. Oh. I can light things by touch. Alright. Or by walking by. Oh, I kind of remember parts of this.
Okay, this is actually kind of terrifying. Ugh. Grab booties. Hey, I got sick from mall food. I wasn't good mall food. I'm working today if you want to say hello. Yep, there's my life right there. Morning. I'm working today. Angus is out of town and lonely. Okay, bye. Hmm. All right, did I move those boxes? Enificine. I'm um, enjoying the game pretty good. Um, yeah, okay, Dad still has to move boxes. <coughs> oh, hey, I can look at this bird cage. What are you even thinking about in there? Being a bird and not a sentient cat like me. Bookshelf is like a ghost of Granddad, hanging out in the corner. Maybe not his ghost, like his skeleton. Ugh. Oh yeah, I just made myself sad. Why did I come over here? Oh, hmm. There's like something written inside this book cover. Left 45, right 100, left 22, left 90, right 15. Left 45, right 100, left 22, left 90, Right, 15. Is this like, what is this? I know, writing it down. Hmm. Hey, Trion. Mom here today? Hey, Mom. Good morning. Did you feel it last night? No. But you know what I'm talking about, right? Spill it, Mom. It was a big sinkhole two streets over. Oh. Oh, are we still getting those? I don't think those ever really go away. Swampy ground and so forth on a floodplain. How oh, weird. I don't want you over there nosing around it. I guarantee you I won't. I have seen sinkholes. No interest at all? Mom, they're just a hole in the ground. Get back to me when one, like, swallows a house or something. We'll go see together if that happens. Deal. What'd you do last night? Went to the Mall of B. Oh, Fort Lucene? Yeah. Haven't been there in years. How is it? Kind of falling apart and empty. Yeah, I expect. Everyone just goes to the outlets stores by the interstate now for you know shoes and things well stop by the church if you're in the area we will do mom see ya mm, bye sweetie mm -hmm. oh it's raining well sure is fall all the road work crammed in before winter Makes like half the town inaccessible unless you want to walk the long way around for like 20 minutes, which I mean, no. Okay. No, I don't think we've actually talked to our parents about dropping out.
Hey, Summers. Now we all know how important it is to look our best. What? Our appearance is the first and sometimes last impression we make. Summers, did you join a cult? Lucky for you, I happen to be a licensed dealer. Uh, okay. Of the Sylvan family of products. Summers, I don't have any money. Oh, okay. Have you sold anything yet? Sold some to my mom and to A.B. Krangler. Mrs. Krangler's daughter? Granddaughter. I ran into her in the laundromat over by the school. One time, Greg got locked inside one of the tumble dryers. Did he die? He wanted me to start it, but I chickened out. He definitely would have died. Tell him that. He's still mad. Want to hear a poem? Sure. Sometimes, I think, and start to sink. Oh no. There's more. Sorry. Then I remember. It's October. October? I combine my two favorite months. Fall's real nice. It's the best. Days are gonna start getting shorter soon. It makes me sad. I like it. I love the fall but hate the dark. I like it. You sure do. I've I seen a raccoon. Where? Up in Towny Cemetery. He's a big un. Cool. We wrote the words poet. on this sign. Mm, doesn't really look like it. Oh man, can I just constantly feed rats? There's more of you today. You need more food. Yes, you do. Okay. 
Hey mom. Hey sweetie. Completely forgot where the sanctuary is. You passed the door on the way here. Oh, I thought those were locked. They're locked sometimes. All doors are locked sometimes. Not like saloon doors. Cowboys just walking in and out. That's very rude. The old west was a very rude time. Howdy, partner. Ah, say, hey, say, this is powerful rude. That's like a southern gentleman. He's classing the place up. Taro Nation. Oh, Mom, no more cowboy talk for you. Dag, damn it. I get back to work. Love you. Hey, does that mean I can go in? Oh. Hey again. Hey, your mom will be pretty happy you're here. Oh, I don't, don't I know it. Not a churchgoer? No. Big fan of sleeping in? I mean, aren't you? Can't remember the last time I slept in. Might have been last Saturday. That's not long ago. It's been a very long week. Same, honestly. When did you stop coming? When my mom stopped making me? When I was like 15 or so? Why? I don't know. All sitting and standing? Sing this now, feel this thing now? Well, the feelings are more suggestions. Doesn't feel like it. Well, I hope you come back some Sunday? I guess I haven't seen you preach. Oh, wow. Preach. Kind of has a bad ring to it, huh? Talk? That works. Hey, how are things with the whole Bruce situation? Well, we're praying and gears are turning, but they turn slow. But God can turn any gear they want. And I take comfort in that. Hope it turns out okay. Thank you, May. Hey, listen. You know, if you ever want to talk or have any questions about, like, God? Sure. You always talk to me. It's kind of my, in my job description. Okay. Been in there. Talked to mom already. Um, can I talk to Bruce? Hey, Joe Joe. Oh, okay. You're more of a drifter. Yeah, but it's temporary. Of course, we'll just have to see if you're okay up here. Pastor Kate's been very kind. Oh, hey, thanks for subscribing, Thirsty Kitty. I think Molly. Uh, it's fine. Yeah, all right. You're finding Possum Springs. Nice place, nice people. How long have you been in town, Bruce? Here for a while now? here before back in the 70s. They were looking for miners at least for a while. Got a whole thing going here, Bruce? Yep. Pretty impressive. Thanks. It's really great to meet you. Yep. Alright, troop, let's move out. I'm not so certain that they're happy to see you. What's your story? Got no story. Like, where are you from? North of here. Northeast. Worked on the railroads. Worked some mines. Worked some construction. Had to end up here. String of bad luck. Don't have to talk about it. Never turned down that offer. Go 
can we discuss this indoors? The click clack. That's what I thought. I've created an account specifically for he's loving to now kiss. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna check in with my friends, but I want to go to the click clack. What's going on here? Wet and cold. Smolders wouldn't say that. Hell no, smelters play in any weather. Come rain or come shine, it's always smelter weather. Huh, I can get up here now. Now here's a man who loves statues. Right, done that. Okay, so I can't. That arm get here. Someone just running down the street. Oops, my arm fell off. I'll just come back for that later. Right. Hello. Excuse me. Yeah. Looking for the park store? You just missed it. What? You've got an accent. Where are you from? Russia. How'd you end up all the way out here? There's a game called The Perfect Date. I have not heard of that. Or maybe I have. There's a lot of cat related dating games. I'll write that down. Bum, bum. Taking the Great Eastern Deciduous Trail. See any bears? Not so far. They eat people sometimes. Actually, all your, of your bears around here mostly eat garbage. Rude. My guide said there was a park store here. It's gone. It used to be right here. Now there's a snack falcon. You know where I can get supplies? I mean, snack falcon, dude. I guess I can find something in there. Yeah, man, they got all kinds of cool stuff. Probably all perishable, though. Hmm. Isn't everything perishable? We're all gonna perish. Everything is going to perish. But yeah, they got granola bars, I think. Spezibo. What's that? Thanks. Oh, Russian. Cool. Hey, hey, May May. Jelly, what's up, dude? I was thinking about going to jail. Like, you're planning on going? I think I could break out. Maybe I should, like, test my skills of escape. I feel like the risk of is bigger than any possible reward. Yeah. What brought this up? I had a nightmare about going to jail. My cousin went to jail. My other cousin, Jen, said it was inevitable. Oh man, you're not inevitable. I mean, it's not inevitable. No, go back. I'm definitely inevitable. The inevitable Greg. Is Angus around today? Yeah, he's off doing some stuff. What stuff? Yeah, family stuff. They're not worth talking about. Yeesh. You wanna hang out? 
Yeah, let's roll. Mechanics. The bullet went clean through. You can still see the bullet hole in it. How'd that not kill him? Must have missed all the important parts of the brain. Wow. Yeah, great great granddad was pretty tough. Isn't that the helmet that the fascists were wearing? Ah, uh, no, wrong war. And wrong country. These weren't the bad guys. Read some history. Okay, when did you learn all this stuff? When people kept saying it was a fascist hat? So what are we doing? You up for a crime? A boy am I ever. I mean, kinda did some last night. Oh really? Without me? Aw, uh, dude. You're always my number one crime friend. That is beautiful, dude. What's the plan? Follow me. Yes, dear leader. I'm both a leader and a deer. Ranger cleared up. Weather moves for us. So what do I need the bat for? Ta-da! Oh. F that car up. So... Why? Do you need a reason? No, but I'd like one. Fair. We need the battery out of this car. What for? That's privileged info. Stop calling me private. I ain't in your army. You've been drafted. It's like very unjust. World ain't just. Okay, but what if someone needs this car? I think it's safe to say no one's gonna miss it. Yeah, I guess it's got a tree growing through it. Smash it up. Smash it all up. Smash capitalism. Smash the government. Smash this car. Yarg. Excellent work. Thank you. I agree. You want to do the honors? Am I going to get electrocuted? Should be fine. Car's got a tree growing through it. Probably not electric anymore. Wait, but you want to do it or not? I do. Okay, just grab one of the wires and yank it off. Thanks, I think you can figure it out. Gotta get rid of these leaves first. Sharkle, what are you doing here? You've always been a good friend, May. Every day you'd visit me, you'd remember to click me just to say hello. Yes, I'm an excellent friend. Sharkle, am I dead? No? Oh, that's good. I have things to do. Let's go back. You were meant for great things. Really? Sure. Wow. Yes. Can you be any more specific? Nope. Okay. What? Ha ha ha. Dude. Laughter. Ha 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 ha. Ugh. Ugh. You okay? I think I died. How long was I out? Like five seconds? Oh, weird. Time like stretches. It's a mysterious universe. We good to go with the battery? You know it. Let's get back to the apartment. Taste pennies. And anyway, even if it was, it's got an anarchy symbol on it now, which makes it good, and there's a bolt hole in it. So whoever was wearing it is dead. I don't like wearing the trophy. So you admit that it's fascist. No, I don't. Okay. So what are we doing? Okay, so wait, question. Shoot. What the hell's that? The thing? Yes, obviously the thing. One of those big like robot 
cartoon characters. I used to have the food donkey. I do? OMG! Is that one of them? Are we gonna put one together? Dude, we totally are. This is amazing. Where'd you get it? You know Steve Scriggins? Guy who locked the substitute teacher in the supply closet? Yeah. I mean, he was stuck to her over the longest night break. Survived by eating glue and Spanish notebooks. Steve Scriggins gave you this? Yeah, that guy. He's horrible, man. But he's been hanging out at the food donkey since it's been shut down. And he dug it out for me. This is the first useful thing Steve has ever done. Okay, 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 okay. What do we do? We need to get this old battery into that old thing. Okay, well that sounds straightforward enough. Kinda, it's full of garbage. Too bad you didn't cut yourself on it and get a disease. Too bad you didn't die on the way here. Too bad the robot wasn't filled with angry snakes. And they killed you. Too bad the elevator didn't fall and squash you like a pancake. Oh dude, no that's a phobia. That one at least makes sense. What were we doing again? Oh, this thing smells. That's just how the old machines smell. No, like, I think something was living in here. Hey, I've got an idea. Why don't you stop being so negative? <laughs> Why don't you eat your own neck? That's impossible. Be serious. This is serious business. Oh well. Well, don't mind me. See, I'm already died once tonight. No big deal or anything. What was it like? I saw a shark, I think, and it told me something important. What was it? I don't remember. Couldn't have been that important. True. Let's do this. Clamp it. That looks safe. Are you gonna be boring now? Just because you died for like a whole five seconds? Dude, come on. Some people have been dead for like forever. Do you see them whining? Um, right. Either shut up and deal or they become ghosts. Are you saying I should become a ghost? Yeah, carpe diem. Carpe diem. Oh, look who's all fancy in French now. Okay, fine. What are we doing? Now's the best part. We're gonna put the beast together. Do you know how it goes together? Gonna find out. Ooh. Ah, ooh. Ooh. Okay, hello. Here are all the parts. Oh, so many possible combinations. We create our own unique metal offspring. So we just clank these together, slap them together, tighten some screws. What could go wrong? I mean, quite a lot. Lots of times stuff goes wrong. Dude, you are no fun. You literally just died. Alright, well... I guess we'll start with a head. Like, like bits. Curious, actually. Hmm. 
Oh, I'm not gonna give it a cleaver. He is beautiful. He is perfect. Beautiful boy. Robot son. So, this is great and all, but remind me, why did we just put a bunch of garbage together in your living room? And connect it to a stolen car battery? Sorry, leaking acid on the carpet, I think. I don't know. Since you've been back in town, I think I missed Greg of, of a few years ago. Hmm? Like, these days I mostly work all the time, but... Why are you working so much? We got plans. What plans? Bright Harbor. Bright Harbor? Since when? Uh, a year or so now? That's why we're working like seven days a week. But when are you moving? I think in the spring? That's like a few months away. Yeah. Oh, okay. You should come visit when we get settled in. Why Bright Harbor? Oh, May, it's so cool. We visited in the summer. And there's like records, doors, and weird bars, and everyone's cool and like free. Oh. That's where I got my tattoo. What? Yeah. The sheep. Yep. Why a sheep? Tattoo guy was like all the way hot and it didn't even hurt. You have a tattoo. You're moving to Bright Harbor. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Alright, anyway. Yeah, like I was saying. Now that you're back in Prossum Springs, I was like, hey, let's do some crimes again. Ah, dude. Yep. So I was thinking about how to use that for, like, good. So I thought I'd bring this here for Angus. That's beautiful, dude. I'm sure he'll love it. Hope so. Okay, so all we need to do now is turn it on. Well, push the button. Let me push the button. Let me do the button. Dude, it's the least I could do. For my best friend back from the dead. Pizza party next time I die and come back. Dude, that is such a deal. Sweet. Oh god. This side smells even worse. Hope whatever was living here in this hole. Okay, I think I see it. Push it, push it, push it. Bum, 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 bum. Push button. Push button. Okay, leaves. Clean button. Yeah, always got electrocuted. Yeah! Whoa! It lives! Wow, I'm still frying. What the. Hi. Whoa! Hey, Angus. How's it going, May? Good. I didn't die this time. You? Good, good. I'm just gonna lay here for a while if that's okay. Okay. Freaking die tonight. Greg rules. How's work? You know, better than the glass factory. Is it? I've mined, I've ran machines, but now I get to slice steaks. And hawk salamis. I mean, it's either you're on the back, that's for sure. Like, do you like it? I like having a paycheck. Fair. Paychecks, the sweetest meats of all. What do you do tonight? Oh, you know, stuff. I'm tired. I feel like I just did a day's work. You know, there are places you can get paid to work for these days. Oh, really? Yeah, they call it working. Hmm, you kids with your slang. Slang you could pick up at work. Oh, yes, point made. What about those boxes I asked about in the crawl space? Hmm, thinking about it. Watch some TV? For a little bit, sure. Oh, good. Garbo and Malloy. Ah, yes. Doop, doop, doop. Boom. Ah, yes. You know what we like to get political here? Gotta do it. Hear about this new law on the books? Pirating a movie online. You know about that? I do. Pushable by up to 10 years. No, punishable up to 10 years in prison. Hey, George. 
Wow, and here I've been trying to get in the hard way. He has, folks. Wonder if pirating a movie about first degree murder earns you more prison respect than one about grand larceny. Hey, Malloy, you know what I think about the law? Like Carbo. That's a whopper. Ha 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 ha. Coming up next, stupid sandwiches. Oh, well, that was fun, Dad. Guess I'm going to bed. Oop. Bum, bum, bum. Hey May, you wake? Sure am. What's up? Nothing. Watching TV. What are you watching? True crime show. Is it any good? Nah, the reenactments are terrible. But if they were good, I'd like actually feel bad for them. As it stands, it's just like bad local commercial actors. Pretending to murder or be murdered. I love those shows. They're the best. Hey punk. You still electric? Nah, I think it's gone now. Hold on, let me touch something metal. Okay, I touched my futon frame and we're good. Good work, Dr. Science. Does Angus like the robot? I think so? He's kind of looking at it. Hold on, I'll ask him. Oh, he says yeah. He Okay, he says to say thank you. So I think that means he likes it. Alright, Duder, I'm turning in. Me too. See you later. Hey, May, are you alright? I was afraid you were really hurt and you left so quickly. I'm good, big guy. Okay, just wanted to make sure. Oh, I appreciate it. Try not to almost die anymore tonight. No promises. Hey, Charcoal. Hey. Bedtime. Sleep, sleeps. We get weird dream. We get one of those tonight. Oh, we do. Hey, Croc Five. Thanks for the follow. Welcome to the squad.
Welcome. Hey, I work all day. Let's say hello. Here to be helloed at. Update. The robot's ro ra blah. Robot ra. Mm -hmm. The robot smells a little weird. Not sure what we missed there. Anyway. Hey boyo. I work all day. Very bored. Work sucks. Crap falcon more like it. Move the boxes yet? Nope. Gotta go talk to mom. Yawn. Morning. Long night. Yep. Ah, remember those big robot things from the food donkey? Mm, you were scared of those. Cried your little eyes out. Oh, it wasn't that bad. Hmm. I remember the stall. Mm-hmm. You okay? Yeah, I've just been doing boring adult stuff. What kind of adult stuff? I'm adult stuff. Just like budget, bills, numbers. A lot of adulthood is number stress. That sounds bad. I'm bad at numbers. Oh, I remember. Okay, well, I'm gonna head out. Mm-hmm. Have a nice day. Direction still happening. Boom, boom. Hey, what's up, Selmers? You know what's good? Off the top of my head. Ooh, not seriously injuring someone during their first kiss at Cedar Prop. Um. I was gonna say those fruit snack thingies we used to eat in grade school. All oh, right, yeah, those are really good. Did that other thing happen to you? Nope. Want to hear a few new poem? Sure. But sometimes I like fruit snacks out by the train tracks. Decent. A juice box and headphones. I enter the juice zone. And those are like all I want now. You made them sound so real. I can taste the atomic dino snacks in the blue killer squeezer. Thanks. I think Mr. Foggy's up there again. Oh really? He's gonna fall right off that soup one day. I can see the water tower from my back window. I've seen a fire up there the other night. Wonder who was up there. Hmm. Whoop. Fell off the stairs. Gotta go look at stars. Oh hey, there's a bunny girl down there. I'll have to talk to her. Do, do, do. No! Oh wait. Can I? Nope. Okay, now I do have to go up that way. May. Yep. Up here on my roof. Yep. Come to hunt some dusk stars? Definitely. Come have a look. Filter. Ugh. Boom. Found one. Let's see. Ah yes, Simone the fighter. 
She got a gun. Simone lived in a good land. But under every good land are the roots of oppression. In this land, those roots took hold and choked out all else. That was poetic. Thanks, I was just reading the summary off my phone. Oh. We may not have signal, but we have Wi-Fi. Anyway, when the borders closed and the curfew began, Simone and her comrades began to plot. They infiltrated, they sabotaged, they freed prisoners. Oh, very nice. Simone was the one of the first to be identified, but she evaded capture even as the wanted posters went up. As whispers of her grew throughout the land, more and more of her neighbors prayed in the night that Simone would be their salvation. Was she? We do not know where Simone is buried. Oh. Well, I knew this wasn't going to be happy. We do not know that when things boiled over, she led a charge against the palace gates. And behind those gates, the cannons. Oh no! Many years later, when the mass graves were exhumed, her bones were mixed with so many others, it was said that she now lives on, in the bones of all in her country. Well, that got dark, and sad, and spooky. Bye, Zersh Kitty! See you later! Wahaha! <laughs> that is history! Alright, well, found one star. Gonna go find the other one. There we go. Found one, found one, found one. Let's have a look. Sterling the Seer. How come I've never heard of these guys? Eh. By the time they got to these rare stars, the well-known myths and legends were taken. Oh. This one, Sterling, is a tale of the world changing and leaving one behind. Is it all gonna be bummers, huh? That is not for me to say. It is a bad thing for the world to move on? Well, I mean, this guy probably doesn't think so. Either way, one day, this king met a new sage, an astronomer, and she showed the king how the planets and stars orbit in regular patterns and why, and the king kicked Sterling out of his quarters. For the seer had long told the king a different story about the stars. Sterling believe his own story? I believe he did. Well, that's how things go. Is there no responsibility to care for those whose labors, even one's universe, are suddenly replaced with a new one? Are they obsolete? Hmm, no? What is to be done? I don't know. Uh, isn't there some other job the king could give him? Or some way where he doesn't have to be useful to the king in order to survive? It's one to ponder. The stars, they make one think. That's both of them for today. Neato. Well, that was pretty great. Come by again. Couple days. We shall hunt the stars. talk to you. Alright. Oh, hello. Wife long gone, kids don't care, tunnel fish are always there. Yeah, man. Oh god, please don't listen. Okay.
Go feed rats. All right, Miracle Rats. Food time. Oh. There are more of you now. So many of you. Someday you won't need me anymore. And you'll leave. Will I even recognize you on the street? As we pass each other. I love you, miracle rats. Oh, I watched an achievement. Hey kid, what you up to? Hey adult, nothing. Sounds good. I was gonna go down to the tracks. Did you want to come? Sorry, that sounds boring. You don't have to go. It's okay. Well, at least let me answer before you decide I said no. Okay, did you want to go? Sure, let's go. Yeah, it'll be fun. Let's rock. Wow, it's been a while since I've been here. My house is like three minutes from here. Got the longest night lights from last year still up. Ha, someone on my street does that too. We got pumpkins last year and we left them out too long. And they like, liquefied. Gross. Oh really? I'm sorry. Ah, it's cool. Gross is fine. I've seen like a time lapse video of when a corpse decays. And like, everything liquefies. We're all goo deep down. Yep. Okay, so like, a cool thing to do is squish a metal thing on the tracks. I like that a lot. Cool. I brought a little metal dude. Let's see what happens. Sounds good, kid. I come out here at night sometimes and fall asleep between the tracks. Why? I don't know. I feel excited and I can I can sleep. You ever have that? Where you're so excited you go to sleep? I have stress dreams if I'm too keyed up. I don't remember my dreams. Sometimes I fall asleep for like five minutes. Sometimes it's for like an hour. That's some risky business there. I have weird thoughts. Like sometimes I want to go sleep in the woods or in the basement of an abandoned house during the day. I only come out at night and be like a monster and like beautiful. I know the feeling. I want to eat people sometimes. Really? Pretty much as soon as I meet anyone. I wonder what they taste like. I think the world's full of bad people. It would be good to eat. Mm hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see what we got. 
Whoa. Yeah. Your little metal guy's all, wow. He represents the human soul. This is important art. Hey, Valkyrie. Yeah. Well, I gotta get rolling. Okay, okay, okay. Let's roll. See ya. Horror movies and trains. Oh, hey, Angus. Hey, May. How's video land? Good, good. Start of the Halloween rush. Got a pretty good horror section. Nice. You got a favorite? What, horror movie? Yeah. Black Oaks. Oh, nice, witchy. Yeah, it's witchy as hell. And scary. Yeah, that one's like historical. The witchy version. Well, see you later. Bye. I'm gonna go up to the church. Yeah, I think we're gonna hang out more with, uh, with B. Talk to mom. Hey mom. Can't talk today. Lots to do. Really? What could possibly be going on? We have a town council here today. And after that, a 12-step program meeting in the basement. Oh wow. I'm doing both church budget and our budget at the same time. I'll leave you alone then. Thanks, son. He's very nice. Yeah, and he could be like, first, a trial run. Where would you put him? Oh, in the basement. Or in the old library? With all the books? He's not going to eat them. Interesting proposal, Kate. Yes, thank you for bringing this to us. I look forward to us moving together uh, forward on this. We brought up at the town council meeting. Oh, that's wonderful. All right, troops, move out. House things. Okay, weird dreams. Wanna talk about it? Not really. I dreamed I was trapped in a wall. Jeez. No, that was fine. I knew the rescue crew was coming in a few hours. And it was cozy, so I could take a nap guilt-free. You feel guilty about naps? Wish I didn't. How's that whole thing with Bruce going? Hopeful and positive. It sounds like some what someone says when they're not. It's fine, May. It's going fine. like Bruce is out here. Oh, no, he's way over here. Seen a fire through the trees last night, past these woods here. Weird noises. I just kept to myself, and they went away. It sounds spooky. I've been around a lot of places. Ain't spooked by much, but out past that water tower. Yeah, that's the place where teens hang out. Let's hope that's all it was. In my experience, strange fire and strange voices ain't never been good. I wonder if they'll be back. Hope not. Fair enough. Bum, 
Hey dude, hello. How's work in here going? Ah, I don't know. It pays. Like refuse to unload all that rock salt by myself. It's not even Halloween yet. Hey May, how's pickaxe? Trying to kill me unsuccessfully thus far at least. What's so stressful? Well, on top of everything else, we're hosting that stupid horror fest play tomorrow. Oh wow. Yeah, I'm never offering to do this again. What are you up to tonight? Ah, oh, nothing. Like, super tired. Because everything about my life is exhausting. And I'm doing the work of like three employees plus a store owner. Even though I'm one employee and I do not own this store. Weird. I thought for some reason you own this place now. You'd think. But also, no, I'd rather die. Literally make me a coffin. Using materials and tools from this store. And bury me anywhere else. Well, that got intense. Arg. Anyway, I'm doing nothing tonight. I can do nothing too. Fine. Are we doing this? Mm, I do want to hang out with you, but I want to go look around town first. Hello. Hey, CJ. Yeah? You were like in high school when I was in middle school. Oh, huh. Did I know you? You used to play nerd games with Tom Bramwell across the street from my house? Ha, ah, nerd games. That's quite a memory you got there. Do you live there anymore? Nah, just back visiting. For nerd games? They were like pen and paper role playing stuff. Cool. But no, I'm just visiting family. Husband's driving down tomorrow. What do you do now? Lawyer? Oh wow. Can I ask you some law stuff? Well, I'm not acting in a professional capacity, but yeah, sure. What's the best way to get out of jail? Depends on the situation. Like, would you dig through the wall? Or... Like, attack a guard and then take their pants and identity? Or like, I don't know, just cause a riot or something? Huh. What's the best prison gang? Like, if you had to pick. No, we don't really learn this kind of stuff in law school. What's the point of, like, going to college if you don't learn useful stuff? Laws are pretty useful. Useful? I don't think so. Sorry, welcome back, have a nice visit, bye. Oh, see ya. Can't go in the diner. Oh, I can go past it though. Oh, right. Food donkey's way out here. Hey, Germ. Hey. Wanna hang out? I know, I'm supposed to hang out with Greg for Bay tonight. I'm not asking to run away and get married. No. Okay. Bye. Bye. Found the border. I can't get out that way to see the repairman. <laughs> Sun again, thank goodness. It's got you down. Yeah, that's nothing. Yeah. Go smelters, right? Yeah, go smelters. 
Let's hang out. Hey B. Hey May. Hi Germ. Hey dude. Germ is helping me move stuff for under the table cash. Well, I'm knocking off work early to pick up some groceries. Wanna come? Yeah. Grocery shopping. Ready to go? You got a lot of hammers. Oh, there's so many kinds of nails. Alright then. He's like out something out of a children's book. About whatever the hell he is. Dinner at B's. This place killed the food donkey. Yeah, kinda. Food! You know, no one who works here had anything to do with that. True. Okay. I need to grab a few things quick. Oh, I thought we were gonna hang out. Uh, we are hanging out. I'm just here to grab something for dinner for dad and me. Don't feel like doing the big shop tonight. Let me pick out what we have. Oh, I'm sorry, are you coming to dinner? Can I? Um, I guess? Are you asking? I wasn't, but now it feels weird not to. I'll pick out what we eat then. Wait, you're serious? Yeah. You know what? Go for it. I hate shopping. Need like a main course and two sides. Counts as a main course. And stop back in the meat section once you pick out whatever else. What about dessert? We're not children. Appetizer? We're on a budget, May. Okay, okay, okay. You hang out and I'll be right back. Make it quick and not too horrible. Also, Dad's sensitive to broccoli. Oh, and no shoplifting this time. Aw. I can afford a few groceries, May. Also, this place has cameras. Good point. You need a canned good or something. Tash, GBs, kind of weird chicken. Oh, let's get green beans. Green beans. Grab something from a box. Mac and cheese. Cooler. Bum, bum, bum. Quick skits. Cream greens. Well, we already got bean greens. Let's get quick skit biscuits then. Should I get bakey shaky? That goes well with meat. Yes. Dad works at the deli. We should go there for the meats. Okay. Hey there, ladies. Hey, Dad. Hey, Bay. Long time no see. How are you, Mr. Borowski? Can't complain. Just me and the meats. Meat friends! Helps to stay friendly with your prime cuts and best fishes. True. Still weird seeing you here. Beats the alternatives. I think I saw my old music teacher when we came in. Oh yeah, that was Mr. Armistead. Looks like it's his job to say hello to people? Yep. Called the greeter. I knew I recognized him from somewhere. Alternatives? Not working. Oh. So what are you little ladies doing here? Grabbing something for dinner. How's your dad? Alright. What can I get for you? Chicken, pork chops, fish, ground beef. Let's get chicken. Hmm, don't want to pull the trigger on these meats. Yes. We 
You should come by for dinner sometime. At the Ham Panther? At home, May. I'll grill us something nice. We can chop up just about anything back here. That would be nice, thank you. Yeah, okay, let's get our meats. Alright, dinner decided. I'm not even looking at what you got. It's how straight up tired I am. It's gonna be great! Alright, let's keep moving. Alright, ladies, let's see what you got. Mm-hmm, yes, okay, looks completely 100% okay. Okay. Tell your dad I said hello. See you later, dad. Night, ladies. That was fun. Yep, groceries. Really makes you appreciate life. Your sarcasm is invalid. Shopping is fun! Woohoo! Dinner time. This is okay. Thanks. Yeah, it's alright. Thanks. Yeah, it'll do. Thanks? You'd find May. Thanks. Can't go wrong with meat and carbs. Thank you, May. I'm real good at food. Food is good. There is a best meal chivo you can get, although it's largely a matter of looking into it. <laughs> it's okay sometimes. Sometimes. Food is real good. Noted. So yeah, we're all paid up till the 15th next month. Safari Man, hey, thanks for resubscribing. All right. That rock salt started? Yeah, should be fine. Rob's still driving that big truck? As far as I know. Okay, uh, I need you to sign some things, left them on the bar. I think I might just get to them. Please do, we have to pay the guys in a few days. I don't need you to remind me. I know, but... I don't, Beatrice. Whose name's on the deed? Yours, Dad. Whose name's on the checks? Yours. Smelter's playing tonight. We're gonna go hang out in my room. Yeah. Girls have a nice time. Thanks for dinner, May. Yep. <laughs> Smelters, huh? You fan? Not really. You don't know what you're missing. Oh, trust me. I know exactly what I'm missing. My parents watch the smelters pretty religiously. They raised you right then. What happened? I have no idea. Did you guys just move in? Ten months ago. Why aren't you unpacked? Pretty cool record player. As far as record players go. It was my mom's. I don't have any records. I don't get records. My mom was into them. They were retro, retro when she was my age. They're, pretty, they're retro now. That's how retro works. So, I've got a question. Mm-hmm. What exactly does your dad do at the store? These days, not much. Some administrative stuff. Hires to repair guys. Sometimes goes out on jobs. That's kind of his whole area. That's about it. Yeah, but still his name on everything. Yep. Meanwhile, you're basically running everything. Yep. And, and, working there every day, too. Yep. I just think you shouldn't. Okay. Uh, probably just quit? Or like, take over the store? Like, you're not doing anything about it, just reinforces. Is really the road you want to go down with this? It's not right that you roll over and take it. Take it? Take it. You're doing all the work and he's getting all the credit. Oh, go to hell. What? You heard me. What is your problem? Here's some reality for you. You know Creek? Repair guy? Creek at the shop? Yeah? Yeah, you met him when we were kids. When I was 15, he asked my dad if he could teach me how to drive. My dad said no, and then told me not to be alone with him. 
Yeah, exactly. And you know what? He still works for us. Why haven't you fired him? I can't fire people. And even if I could, he's on the crew. And frankly, he's our best guy. Practically heads up the repair team. Since my dad's barely doing anything. And Creek's got a family. He needs to work. It's disgusting. It's not your responsibility to do. I know. Don't you think I know that? I'm just saying, if you keep letting these dudes off the hook... Off the hook? Like, you're stronger than this, Bay. You're like... Badass and... Whoa. My mom dying was not very badass. Me sitting in my room right now, not very badass. Sorry, I... You're such a shithead, you know that? Garg. A lot of time folks can't just choose to do whatever it is you decree to be the right thing. A lot of times people do the things they do because they can't do anything else. Choose what? Honestly, tell me. What is my choice here? Tell your dad you're not going to take us. Tell him what? What is your magic solution? That I need to do. Seriously, going to punch your lights out. Come in here and start telling me how I'm screwing things up. You want to come in here and say, Oh yeah, just ditch your dad. He's both getting old. You can barely get off the couch half the time. You want to come in here and say, Oh yeah, just start this big drama and make your life way more stressful. It's just not right. Yeah, it isn't. Nothing's right. The whole effing world isn't right. Greg is probably off doing god knows what wacky shit. I'm here making dinner and doing payroll. You know like nothing about my life. You just know what I should do. And you're the last person I'd ask for advice. Yeah, you're sorry. Everyone's sorry. You don't get it. You're just like the other night, but all the time. Running around messing with people and taking whatever you want while the whole mall is falling apart around you. I thought you had a good time. I should go. You should go. Chicken dinner, like mom. Ham, panther dinner. Had a fight. How did I mess that up? Wanted to help. Garbage football. Oof. What's up? Long day. Yeah, same here. I was socializing. Surprisingly tiring sometimes. Yeah, that's why I don't do much of it. Wasn't surprised seeing you at work tonight. Yeah, I can't believe I hadn't visited yet. Well, you haven't been back long. And you're not usually lurking at the Ham Panther. Who's to say I'm not? It was nice seeing you anyway. Lurk, lurk. Any idea what was up with mom today? Oh, she's just stressed. That's vague. I hate to be the one to break it to you, but you spent a lot of adulthood being vaguely stressed. Aw, oh, dang. I thought the stress would at least get more specific. Oh no, you'll have that too. Hmm. Cheer up, kiddo. It's only life. Gee, thanks, Pop. How are those crawl space boxes? Yeah, okay, I'll move them. TV time? For a little bit. Hey, Anima. Do, do, do. And we're back. Great crowd here tonight. We'd never leave for too long, folks. Say it, Garbo. Yeah, Malloy. Crowds like this remind me of our early days. I disagree. None of them are angry and drunk. Most of them, anyway. No, I mean those old nights, those good nights. Just the heat of the stage lights and the thrill of winging it. And the gentle thump of an empty beer bottle thrown at your head. Ha 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 ha. These days, things are pretty cushy. You think we're getting soft? You sure are. Around the midsection. That's a whopper. Ha ha ha. My lights company policy to never body shame. Oh, I never worry about that, Garbo. Why is that, Malloy? I'm what you call body shameless. Ha <laughs> ha Coming up next, Garbo and I go counseling. Well, that was fun. Oh. 
Boop, 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 boop. Computer. Hey, Bay, you there? Yep. I don't really know how I screwed that up, but I'm sorry. It's fine. Going to sleep. See you later. Okay. Uh, I don't think that was fine. Hey, kid. Hey, ho. What you up to? Nothing kind of bummed tonight. Oh, why? No reason. Just happens. Must be going around. Just got into a fight with Bay. Oh no, about what? I don't even know. I think I'm just kind of an a-hole. You and me both. The a-hole twins. Get matching jackets with that on the back. Varsity jackets. With giants, giant a-hole patches on the sleeves. Ha 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 ha. Alright dude, I'm cashing out for the day. See ya dude. <laughs> Bedtime? Do we get another weird dream? Whoa. Windy. Wait, are we on a train? Oh, we're on a train.
jump on that roof. All right, I'm um, gonna actually leave that here. It's 10 to, but um, yeah, I'm gonna leave that here. I think it'll be fine. Oh, we could just stop after a weird dream. So our next uh, stream's gonna be on the 1st of December at 4 in the afternoon. Thanks, Kavina. Um, uh, we're gonna start doing the streaming for 25 days straight thing. There's a specific schedule down below uh, in the schedule section, but also in the other section, and I tweeted about it. I'll probably make uh, tweets weekly or daily or something about times. Uh, we're gonna continue on with this game until we finish it, and then um, I do have a copy of Danganronpa 2 coming. It's not here yet. If that doesn't show up first, we'll probably have to find something else to play. We'll see where that goes, but I at least have a couple games. Uh, I do have a couple of streams over that period of time that are like only an hour long. Those streams will probably just be like a rhythm game or something short as opposed to something that we're actually in the middle of that's deep because I don't want to do that for only an hour but yeah it should be fun and I think it'll be it'll be an interesting experiment I'm sure and anyway uh, thank you for hanging out lurking chatting subscribing following cheering it's been great you all take care